Hey guys, I have March's Japan Crate finally. And we're just gonna get right into it and show you the goods. Okay, so, is that a box? Hmm? You got the box? Alright, you got the box, I got the book. Alright, so, uh, right off the bat, I see another Cheetos product. This one is, uh, looks like Kyushu soy sauce. Um, why does Kyushu matter? Because apparently the soy sauce is a little bit sweeter than regular soy sauce. So, uh, looking forward to those. You know, the barbecue ones from last one were pretty good. Still used to the cheesy ones, but we'll give those a shot too. This is interesting. This is, um, Umakaman mayonnaise. This is a mayonnaise snack. Um, I'm guessing it's on a corn puff. Maybe. Sounds kind of corn puffy. But apparently uh, mayonnaise is a wonderful loved condiment in Japan. And they make snacks out of it. So that's going to be exciting. Let's see. What is this? This is... This is banchiage. Banchi rice snack. Uh, so these are rice crackers that are soy sauce flavored. And um, these, I think I've had something like this before. It's just, it's a round rice cracker and they're usually flavored, you know, I think shrimp is usually the most popular flavor. But I guess you can flavor them with anything. So that's going to be cool because I like crispy rice crackers. Okay. Okay, we have our do-it-yourself kit in this one. This one is the Yayosan soft candy do-it-yourself kit. So I'm guessing this is just like... Maybe some squishy candy that you just make into the shapes and then eat it. So we'll have to do that sometime. Alright, we have... <clears throat> I'm just pulling out the big items, guys. This is Pinomi Matcha flavored. So these look like little um, fluffy pastries with like some matcha cream inside. And that's like... I've had something like this with like strawberry cream inside before. And they're really good. I like those a lot. What else do we have, huh? We have another... Ooh, we have a Mibo stick again. These are apparently really popular snacks. This one is shrimp mayonnaise flavor. So we have a little bit of a mayonnaise theme going on this time. Um, I've never had shrimp mayonnaise before, but I'm hoping it tastes good. <laughs> Alright, we have... Oh, this is like the last one. This is strawberry uh, daifuku, or ichigo daifuku. And so it's going to be marshmallow with strawberry inside. Just like the last one we had, had chocolate inside. We have the Japanese version of a ring pop, diamond ring candy. So I wonder how much different it looks. Mine feels like it might be melted. No, maybe it's just a lot smaller than the ones we have here. <clears throat> what else do we got, huh? Whoa, what is this? This is huge. Country Mom chocolate chip cookies. Um, I didn't expect that to be so good. It looks like you can microwave these. On the back there's microwave instructions, I guess, so it can come out like homemade cookies. That's pretty neat. So I guess maybe you can make them cold or hot. Hmm, I'm gonna have to look up these instructions. That's gonna be fun. This is Japan's number one longest chocolate. It is, um, it's the same thing as the Amiibo chocolate. So it's the corn puff that's covered in chocolate, and this one just happens to be like three times as big. <laughs> so it's huge. Uh, let's see, this is something that looks similar to that ramen pack we had in the last one, but this one is sobameshi, and it's uh, like soba noodles that's like, it seems like stir fried and crunchy. So that's going to be like another kind of uh, savory, crunchy snack. I'm looking forward to trying that. I've never had anything like that before. Alright, what do we have here? Okay. Oh, this is like one of those giant panda face cookies. This is melon pandaro. So I'm guessing this is melon flavored. And I do like melon flavored anything because it's really, really delicious. Except for actual melons. Except for watermelons. Watermelons are the only good melon. <laughs> uh, this is a Bono Bon Creamy Cream. So, um, I'm not sure what flavor this is. Apparently milk chocolate filled with creamy peanut butter and a layer of wafer cookie. Okay, that's self-explanatory. That's, I don't think I've ever had anything like that either. So that's going to probably be really, really delicious. 
And we have a tiny little candy here. This one is Awadama Grape. So I'm guessing it's a, like a fizzy hard candy. And yeah, it says it's like a soda, but in bite-sized form. That's pretty cool. And so our drink, which is a nice full-size bottle. I love it when they put in the bigger bottles of drinks instead of little tiny cans. This I've been looking forward to because I saw it when they advertised it. This is Calpis White Peach, also Calpico in other countries, but usually it's just regular um, yogurt flavor, and, but this one's peach, and it's going to be amazing and delicious. So don't forget to like us and subscribe so that you don't miss when I taste it for you and tell you how it is. We'll see you next time. Bye!